Well, as Chris mentioned, police are alleging the death of Kevin Kane was caused by just one punch. For years, the government, police, community groups and lawyers have joined forces to push the message, one punch can kill, but is it sinking in? We're joined by criminal defence lawyer Bill Potts. Bill, thanks for joining us. We, we can't obviously talk directly about the, the latest case, but no doubt you've seen lives destroyed by a punch to the head. I've seen many lives destroyed quite often for reasons which, when people look back, bear absolutely no resemblance to reality. People affected by alcohol, sometimes by anger, and sometimes by simply sheer stupidity, involve themselves in, in fights. One punch can kill, and one punch often does kill. So can we blame these incidents on alcohol and the other factors you mentioned? It's very easy to seek blame everywhere, uh, but the sheer reality is that Young men often affected by alcohol, though in this particular case I suppose it's no respecter of age, but people sometimes simply enraged in a moment uh, of madness uh, do something silly which destroys uh, the life of another person and then the uh, sequelae to that is that they go to jail for a substantial period of time. Lives get destroyed, one punch kills. Can any factors diminish responsibility for the person who's made the assault? Of course, there's also uh, the mixture of people defending themselves or defending others. Sometimes it's an accident in the sense that it, it's not something that they intended to happen. But at the end of the day, uh, a man dead and another man facing serious charges is a tragedy for everybody. Bill, what more can we do? Public education is important, uh, but I'm afraid that the uh, police and uh, many people see that this message is falling on deaf ears. The reality is that people think that they're 10 foot tall and bulletproof. We have to think before we drink, and we have to think that every punch, every blow and every fight can destroy another person. People simply have to think before they uh, act in any way, shape or form. Bill Potts, thank you very much for your time. Anytime. That's fine. A 36